I just told myself what is happening at my back. I, I know I could not see my back. Let me let's do an experiment. Don't try this at all. Welcome back to my channel. It's your favorite person in the planet, and I'm back at your screen with another <laughs> video. And in today's video, as you guys can already tell by the telling of this video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys a story time and how I got a product that didn't work for my skin and how I managed to formulate an ointment that I used in taking care and getting rid of my white patches. I know a lot of you will be like, why does she have a white patch? Oh, a whole blue loves like you have are you kidding me? You have white patches on your hey! After all the old reviews, you see, ended up with white patches. Ah, now nah, wow. No, don't, don't even judge me in the comment section. Don't let us even quarry, okay? I'm gonna tell you how the white patches arrive, okay? But before we dive right in into this video, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, girl, you're already here. So you might as well just go hit the subscribe button and just, you know, join this family. Forget that my voice is loud. I'm actually begging you, subscribe. I beg. Biko. Let's dive right in into this video. Anywho, guys, I am back with another banger as usual. And today I'm gonna be sharing with you a story time of how I went to go and buy products that I saw another content creator was reviewing on their channel. I went ahead to purchase it. I didn't do my own research on these products before purchasing it, which is the reason why whenever I come here and I do a lot of reviews for you guys, I still like you to go and do your personal research about the products because there are so many things you still need to find out when you do your own personal research. So learn from my own story story okay from my own experience I want you guys to learn something from this experience that I'm gonna be sharing with you guys first off when I started to use my smart body spray the first time I started to use smart body spray don't get me wrong this is my favorite body spray to use it is affordable and it lasts longer in my own opinion okay don't come after me I know yes I'm cheap thank you very much but it is not your money. I started to use the Smart Body Spray collection at the time and then I noticed that I was having white patches. I did a video where I was talking about how I got rid of my white patches using just coconut oil. So guys, I used coconut oil when it first happened to me while I was using the Smart Body Spray. Then I was not even using any lotion so that I could actually have said, oh, it was the lotion that was causing the white patches. But then it was just only the body spray and I always apply the body spray directly on my skin. And if you have used Smart Body Spray before, you know it has so much gas and it's kind of really harsh on the skin for some people that have sensitive skin. But then I did not care. I just loved applying body sprays on my skin and the Smart Collection at that. So I was using the Smart Body Collection and then white patches came me and draw the map of Africa, royal map of Liberia on my two shoulders. And then I went ahead and got my coconut oil because coconut oil is an antibacterial oil that helps with these process. Like it helps with dermatitis, eczema, and the rest of the other bacteria skin problematic issues that appears on the skin. Oh my God. Oh, oh, I can speak grandma. Ew. <laughs> I can speak grandma. When I started to apply the coconut oil, it got rid of the white patches, okay? And then before you know what is happening, my white patches was faded up. And I did a video telling you guys how you can use the coconut oil to get rid of your white patches, which actually did work for me and still does work. Okay, moving on, I stopped using the Smart Body Collection. Then I started to use something else until Smart Body Collection released a new collection again. And you know, it was so enticing. It's not so nice that I was so tempted and I got it again, thinking that by now, my skin would not react to the newest collection from Smart. Okay, so I got it and then I was using it and then before you know what is happening, white patches started to appear at the back of my shoulders and also at my back. I could not see the, the white patches because it didn't appear where I could be able to see them. It appeared on my neck and also at my back. But before I got to know that this thing was actually there, it had gone so far. Believe me. So far. And then, one day I was walking and my mom just told me, what is this at your back? And then I just, I just told myself, what is happening at my back? I, I know I could not see my back. Let me, let's do an experiment. Ah! 
Don't try this at all. I could not see my bag, so I could not even tell if there was any white patches on my bag. And then I went online to start Googling because I had an event. I went ahead to Google online to find something that would actually hasten the process because I know coconut oil takes its time. It is a slow process of fading off the white patches. And I really needed to get these white patches gone because I needed to slay. White patches will not let me slay. Show me your bag. Bikini, uh, off the shoulder tops. And all of that good stuff. So I was trying to get rid of the white patches, but then sis. Find me in this planet in, in Tobago and in uh, uh, China. You will not even know what is going on with me because this coconut oil was slowing me down. I wanted to get rid of my, my white patches because I had some events that was coming up and I wanted to sleep. But then, catch me outside. How about that? I couldn't find none. So when I came online, I saw Farmadam. I saw somebody on YouTube reviewing Farmadam and NDXG helping to, you know, the both of them are good for fading off white patches. So I got Farmadam and I was using Farmadam on my skin. I didn't even watch the video to the point that I went to do my own personal research which is the reason why you need to do personal research no matter how an inflexor come here and say please uh, rub carotone please use coconut oil please use omoso sister do your own personal research okay just hold on one second the story is still getting juicier so i went ahead and i purchased from them and i was using from them guess what happened the white patches they were drawing more map they were even telling me they are traveling to mediterranean sea <laughs> Trust me, I was like very shocked as you because I thought it was gonna go, but then it was just giving me green veins. And I was asking myself, I am not rubbing any lotion, I am not using my smart body spray. So, where in the hell is this shit coming from? I couldn't get it. Like, I didn't know why my white patches was getting more visible, and then I was having green veins appearing on my shoulder. What I did was I kept using it because I thought, okay, you know what, I have hope it's going to work. As far as somebody has reviewed it, not one, not two people have reviewed it, it will definitely work. So I kept using it and I used the whole bottle and nothing happened. Instead, the green veins was getting more visible, the white patches was doing more map, they were traveling more and more. In fact, they started having girlfriends, carrying them and traveling to different states. You understand what I mean? Anyway, I started having white patches even on my breast and on my chest and everywhere on my stomach the, because that's the places I spray my body spray on. I think here we are. It was nothing was happening so I got the NDXG and I was using the NDXG nothing was happening as well not until I went back to my coconut oil and I was using it it was doing just what it can do because it's not the fastest way to getting rid of your white patches and I really needed to get rid of my white patches faster okay faster faster DJ faster faster DJ but since I ended up with green veins and a worse looking skin because of these two products so then I decided to start using my coconut oil and then I did another research where I found out that tea tree hey Ruwayo now tea tree essential oil actually helps with the white patches with fading off your white patches so I got the tea tree essential oil by the way, that is my favorite tea tree essential oil brand, okay? If you see this in the shelf, please pick it up. I love it so much. Like, I love how it smells and I love the effectiveness of this tea tree essential oil. And please, if you're going to be doing this ointment that I'm going to be sharing with you how to make, please make sure that you don't use only the tea tree essential oil because it's a very potent and concentrated essential oil. So you need a carrier oil to mix with it before you can apply it on your skin. You can decide to add your olive oil or your coconut oil but do not apply this on your skin on its own because it is very strong and potent for your skin. I did my research and I found out that tea tree essential oil helps to fade off the white patches. It helps in darkening those pigments, which is the white dots dots on your skin. So I went ahead and I put my coconut oil and my tea tree essential oil. What I did was I got a coconut oil that was filled up to this point. This is the mixture here, okay? This is the mixture here that I made by myself with my coconut oil and my essential oil. And this is a container from my Shalom Stretch Mark Oil, which I've reviewed for you guys. So I added I added 20 drops of tea tree essential oil into the container and then I did a bit of shake. And that is how I formulated my white smart. Will you keep quiet? Chai. Oh my god. That is how I formulated my, my white patch removing ointment okay now what you have to do is you put in as much coconut oil as you can get and then add about 20 drops of this essential oil into the container and then do a little bit of shake to incorporate both of the oils together and then you start applying on your cleansed skin every morning when i shower i apply it in circular motion and make sure that the oil is fully absorbed into the areas that was actually affected by the white patches and then that was it now the moral lesson from this story is that whenever an influencer comes here comes here to tell you sister Take mud from the sea. Go to Jamaica. Take their soil. Put it inside water. Boil it. 
pound it, rub it on your skin. John, five million times. Then fly on your bed, hundred million times. Why? 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 Stand up again. Then take Omo, points from your head. You will see now, everything that is bothering you, even your family problems, will be gone. No matter how an influencer sit their ass on the chair, sit in front of the camera and tell you, buy coconut, buy this cream, buy container. Please, still do your own personal research. I like it when I come to my comment section, I see someone telling me, I just did my research on the products you just reviewed and this is my findings about it. What did you think about it? Okay, I'm not an island of knowledge, okay? So I would always want you to do your own personal research to know what the products actually does. Now, you guys will be asking me, why was Parmadam giving me green veins and causing my white patches to be more visible? That was the question I was asking myself and my sister. Not until I took the bottle of the Parmadam that I was about to throw away and then I read that it failed off dark spots now when something has started to fade off dark spot what does that tell you there is something lightning inside okay that is why the thing was giving me green veins and also making the white parties travel as much as they can travel it was sponsoring their trip I don't know like everybody will always keep saying what works for me might not work for you maybe it worked for some people but to me it didn't I faded off my white parties using blues formulated ointment now why i decided to use both of these oils to make in my ointment is because coconut oil is an antibacterial oil it helps with eczema also helps with vitiligo and also white patches treatment and then tea tree essential oil helps in fading off the white patches so i joined both of them together making a stronger potent ointment to apply on my skin so guys if you're going to do this please do it and give me your feedbacks in the comment section okay because this actually is very effective anyway that wraps the end of my story time and how how I made my own formulated um, stretch mark ointment so if you guys enjoy this video you've learned one or two things in this video please endeavor to give this video a huge thumbs up okay and then also leave your comments in the comment section don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed to my channel and you're already at the end of this video you're already here so you might as well just go hit that subscribe button okay and then I'll see you guys in another awesome video bye